Next, we want to look at interest. When we put money in the bank, we are paid interest. When we borrow money from banks, we are charged interest. Interest rate is quoted in percentage per annum, that is per year. So, when the interest is 5%, it is 5% per annum. There are two kinds of interest. One is simple interest, the other is compound interest. We are going to look at simple interest first. If you save 1,000 ringgit in a bank, and the bank pays an interest of 5%, how much interest will you get after one year? In simple interest, the interest you get is 1,000, which is the principal amount, times 5%, and we get the interest amount of 50 ringgit. Together with the principal amount, you will have 1050 by the end of the year. So, the amount of interest that we get at the end of the year is P times R, where P is the principal and R the interest rate per year. How much interest will you get after half a year? Again, we will take the principal of 1000 and multiply it by interest rate of 5%. But this time, we only have half a year. So we are going to multiply this whole thing by 1 over 2. And we get 25 ringgit. How much interest you will get after 3 years? Again, we take the principal of 1000 and multiply it by interest rate of 5%. But this time, we have 3 years. So we are going to multiply this whole thing by 3. And we get 150 ringgit. So for the formula P times R, we need to multiply it by T, which is time period in years. So if the principal is 5400, the interest rate is 3.6% and the time period is 2 years 9 months. By the end of 2 years and 9 months, what we get is this. 5400 times 3.6% times 2 years and 9 months over 12 months. And we get 534.6 ringgit. This is the calculation of simple interest.